If you're a ZK Sync farmer, you need to watch this video. So basically what we're going to be doing today is that we're going to be using some bridges to send some funds to ZK Sync because, hey, in the end, we are all farming ZK Sync, but there's something that we never take into account. And it is the amount of money that we're spending on gas fees whenever we want to bridge some funds. So here we have four options. What I'm going to do is I'm going to be spending or sending more or less like $30 using each one of them and we will double check to see how much money we're we are spending on gas fees and also how much money we're going to be receiving on chain so here i have a note i only have two dollars and 77 cents on zk sync so i'm going to be using each one of them we're going to be reviewing how much money we spent on gas fees and how much money we're going to be receiving on zk sync after bridging the good thing is that all of these options are actually tokenless so basically just by using them we might receive an r drop in the future so let's go ahead with number one which is bungee i'm gonna switch my chain to optimism because that's where i have some funds let's go to optimism there we go i have 200 dollars so first we're gonna be choosing ethereum zk sync I'm going to send 0 0.02, which is $32. It says that I'm going to be receiving 29.45. But of course, we do have to double check that. We're going to click on review. And let's go ahead and bridge. It should take around six minutes. So let's go ahead and do that. And to be honest, um, Bungie is actually the slowest. Yeah, I don't know why, but it actually takes some time. If we use any other one, it is actually way quicker than that. So let me go ahead and do a quick pause and I'll be right back. Okay, so now my first bridge is completed. So as you can see, I have $32.21. After removing the $2.77 that I had, I can see that I actually received $29.44. So from 32, let's see, 32.69 plus 0 0.4, which is the gas fees, minus 29.44. I spent in total $3.29. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to add $3.29. So that is actually the amount that I paid for gas fees just for me to receive my funds. It can be um, for slippage. It can be for anything. But in the end, I know that I am actually spending $3.29 just for me to receive those funds. Now, number two, let's go ahead and use Orbiter, which is the second one. So I'm going to be switching to Optimism again. Let's go ahead and do that. And I'm going to send the same amount, 0 0.02. Let's go ahead and click send. Let me double check. Yeah, ZK Sync. Okay, perfect. Let's go ahead and do send. Confirm that transaction. Let's do confirm. And the good thing for Optimism, it is that it is actually super cheap for the gas fees. Let's see. So it was only $0.02. Cents. So in total, I spent $35.31. So let's go ahead and add that. We have Orbiter. Let's do 35.31. That is the amount. So we're going to switch to ZK Sync. Or ZK Sync. There you go. So as you can see, super, super quick. So we're going to do the same calculation as before. So we had $32.21. So I'm going to do 60. How much it was? 62, 64.88. Let's do 64.88 minus 34. Point, no, I'm sorry, the amount we had before, 32.21. 21. So as you can see, not bad at all. So we actually received $32.67. That is the amount that we received, $32.67. And let's double check how much money we spent. 35.31 minus 32.67. So we spent $2.64. So as you can see, Orbiter is actually cheaper then bungee and 64 cents perfect so now let's go ahead and use layer swap for the other one 
So we're going to do the same, 0 0.02. Enter ZK Sync, enter your address. We're going to do autofill. Let's go ahead and confirm that here or connect our wallet. There we go. Okay, swap now. Before I do that, let me go ahead and change the amount that we have now, 64.88. 64.88 send from wallet let's confirm that transaction here oh we need to switch to optimism let's do confirm and we wait a little bit it should take less than three minutes i think let's see It is getting confirmed right here, so we can go ahead and switch to ZK Sync. And let's wait a little bit. Great, so now let's go ahead and do the same calculation. We're gonna do layer swap. I spent $32.67. Let me double check, 69, that would be including the gas fees. Let's go ahead and confirm how much money I received. Um, ZK Sync. No, it is not a hundred dollars. Let's do. There we go. Ninety-five point forty-four. So we're just gonna check how much we had before. Ninety-five point forty-three minus 64.88 that is thirty dollars and fifty five cents so that is the amount that we received thirty dollars and fifty five cents so we just need to do the calculation here thirty two point sixty nine minus thirty point fifty five that's two dollars and fourteen cents so that is actually less expensive also than Orbiter. So as you can see, the first one is Bungie, which is $3, kind of expensive. Then we have the second one, which is only $2.64. And Layer Swap is only $2.14, which is not bad at all. Not bad at all. Super cool. Now we have the third option, which is quite different because here um, we can only bridge some stables. So it will be a different transaction in that case. So we're going to do that. Let's go ahead and connect. We have, um, let's go ahead and switch to optimism. Again, to proceed with the same option. We are on optimism. I should have, so I have $32.11. Let's see how much money I'm going to be receiving. Let me go ahead and add that here. Messenfy, we have 32 and 11 cents. Let's see how much money we're going to be receiving. Let's go ahead and approve that. Let's wait a few seconds and then we should be good to go. There we go. So let's go ahead and confirm that. So $31.49. Let's see actually how much it is. What's the claim? What's that? Claim by joining Spectrum. Nope, not going to happen. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I almost fucked up my transaction. It is actually to ZK Sync. Okay, my bad. $28.87. Let's see how much it is going to be. So, Optimism to ZK Sync. Perfect. Let's go ahead and do that. Sign. Confirm. And let's wait a little bit. 
And there you go. So now I have my funds on ZK Sync, which is against stable. So it is um, $28.87 for USDC. Let's go ahead and check that. It is 11 plus we also spent three cents on gas fees. So it is 32.14 minus 28.87. So let's see how much it is. $3.27. So almost as expensive as Bungie. So let's go ahead and do 28.87, even though it says 88 here. So it is rounding it up. So let's just use 88 and say that we spent $3 and 26 cents in that case. So as you can see, here are the options that you can use to bridge some funds. Of course, we have many, many other options, but the only thing is that if I'm actually farming a project, I would rather just use a uh, a bridge a dex that is also tokenless so hopefully i can receive a double triple quadruple or a drop in the future so here are the four bridges that i'm actually using every day now, as you can see so bungie again it is three dollars and 29 cents orbiter it is two dollars and 64 cents then we have layer swap which is two dollars and 14 cents and messenfy even though it is a little bit different because it is only for stables um it is three dollars and 26 cents so if what you're trying to do is spend the less amount of gas fees i would actually go with layer swap it is also one of the quickest i would say that quickest is orbiter then the second one would be layer swap then the third one is mesonfi and the last one is bungee that one is super slow in comparison to the others but again layer swap is pretty um, fast and also super cheap in comparison to the others. And there you go. So these are the bridges that you can use if you want to send some funds to ZK Sync. Let me know in the comment section if you are actually using any other bridge and if you have found um, anything that is less expensive than what I am actually using today. And also, if this content was valuable enough, please share it to a friend, subscribe, like, happy farming.